Hi, Jessica and Melissa. How are you? Hi. Good. How about you? I'm really well. So don't tell the other people, but your characters were kind of my favorite on the show. Um, I know for the three episodes that I saw, you still kind of suspect you two, but you still want to be your friends and eat the good food at the funeral. We'll I have to say, friend. we'll be your friend. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> I want to sing some Lily Allen. So. Oh. So for both of you, what did you like best about working with each other? I just, I just love Jess. We're in love. Like, yeah. I think what's important to stress here is that <laughs> Melissa and I are in love. And she is my wife. And I think so. <laughs> I'm, but on, on like a genuine note, Melissa is so, so talented. We didn't get to work together at all on the pilot. So we didn't get to work together at all in the pilot. So I didn't really know what uh, I was in for. I knew she was awesome in the pilot because I'd seen it. But um, yeah. And so when we started working together, I was like, Ooh, I have to step it up because this. Same. Person- like Jess is so talented. It like keeps me on my toes. I'm like, okay, I need to stay present and listening and make sure that like we're bouncing but also like it's so easy to bounce off of you because like you're giving so much like it's just it's like I have not had a funner time on set than like with Jess to be honest (laughs) oh you're in love basically (laughs) I see that I support that (laughs) So as, as I was saying, at certain points, you do suspect the different characters of doing it. Um, so did you get all the scripts at once or how did you go about playing your characters? Was everything a surprise? Uh, we got the pilot script for the pilot because we weren't picked up for the whole season at once. It was just a pilot. Right. So we had the pilot script and the book to work off of at first. And then a year and a half passed because of COVID and insanity. And in that year and a half, we got picked up. And then when we got to New Zealand, before we began shooting, we got the other seven scripts. So all of the theories that we kind of had like in our brain for a year and a half, uh, some of them played out, some of them didn't. There was a lot of surprises. There was so, but yes, we did have all eight scripts before we shot the rest of the season. So it gave us, like, we knew, we knew what was going to happen and what we were getting into. So Jessica, what was it like filming the Lily Allen scene? <laughs> <laughs> um, I had to do that for my, both my auditions. So I had already done it a lot in a very awkward situation. I mean, Jennifer Morrison, the director of the pilot, and Erica, yeah. uh, I, I mean, they made me feel very comfortable in the audition room, but it's still really awkward. Um, so I made the decision to learn it on the ukulele and play the ukulele uh, in the audition because originally it was written as like a karaoke track. And I was like, that is not going to go well for me. <laughs> and so then I, uh, I played it on the ukulele and they liked it. And then I went in and did it again. And they were like, we put that in the script. And I was like, if you guys don't cast me and I have to watch somebody else do that, <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, <laughs> am I gonna be sad. Um, so, and then doing it on the day, that was at 4 a.m. And it was freezing oh cold. I mean, I was fine, but Annalisa and Zania and Sarah had to be in those tiny little cheerleading outfits. and. I mean, I really have no reason to complain. Janae wears 18,000 layers at all times. (laughs) um, Yeah, it it was, it was really crazy. It was also the last day of shooting. So it was just kind of, I was not mentally prepared for any of it. So I just was like, I've done it so many times. I just have to do it the way I've done it before. And I am, pleasantly surprised with the way it turned out but I could not remember what I did at all until I watched the show oh my gosh so all of the characters are very afraid of getting their secrets exposed what are some fun facts about each other that other people might not know oh boy <laughs> um, is, um, a fun fact about Melissa is Melissa has taste like <laughs> Melissa is out here 
going to all of the vintage stores and picking out the cutest things, finding the cutest things. She has immaculate taste in books, like just kids she has been living for. Um, and I think we also had a playlist together for, um, for the show. So we would add things to that. And every single song Melissa added was just chef's kiss. Perfect. Flawless. Coming off of that, Jess has literally the best music taste in the world. Like every single song she's ever recommended to me and I listen to, I immediately add to like my liked songs and like multiple playlists. Like there, you have never missed. It's like, it's, and I would never steer you wrong. <laughs> exactly. Okay? exactly. I would never do that to you. Beautiful. No. So now I need to know what was on the playlist. I want to hear these good songs. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Where do we start? I I mean, oh, I there there's a song called um Friday Night Big Screen by Girly that oh. I think is just very on brand for the show. It's very uh our characters yes it's very yeah. like um has a lot of film references and it's very fun and poppy and uh so that was on there Melissa mm -hmm. I think that's kind of like the theme song of the playlist I'm trying to think there's the playlist has a lot of like the regrets on it which I feel like is a band that very much like encapsulates Maeve and Janae's sort of like energy that they put out because it's very yeah. like edgy and like defiant you know, yeah 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 very yeah ratty if you will like it's just it's very yeah it's very on brand for us right I love it so tell me about some of your favorite moments playing your characters without spoiling too much I guess <laughs> I mean I just I know mine <laughs> I had a lot of fun, like uh, for all of it, like every scene of mine, as I'd be reading the scripts, every time I got to a scene of mine, I'm like, this is going to be fun. Like, I, I don't think there was at any point where like I was on set and I wasn't having fun. Cause like Maeve, it's just like, I'm so yes. lucky that I got to play such a fun character. Cause she's just like, I think her circumstances in her life have like mm. toughened her up in a way that she's nothing but like honest and maybe it comes out in a certain way but like I just I just had the most fun just in general like I can't point to one scene in specific because it's all it was all a blast I'll say um there's a scene in episode six that mm. was wonderful to do just gonna leave it there. Can't episode say six, anything. Episode six was very fun to shoot. I will say that. Very oh fun. my gosh. I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> so coming very soon, everyone's gonna be so hooked on this show. What have the two of you been watching lately? Mm, I've been watching Hacks on HBO and I am obsessed. I am I in love. Yeah. I've been re-watching Succession because it's just like... <laughs> my favorite show ever because like I'm re-watching it to get ready for season three because it comes out very soon, soon. yeah between the first and the second drop. <laughs> yeah like it's between the first and second drop of our show um Ted Lasso like their season two is like it's like airing right or not airing but like they're putting it on Apple TV weekly and like it is everything to me and I just binge watched the first two seasons of Dave and it's also fantastic so I would say those three good choices. <laughs> well, thank you so much for your art. Thank you for this show. You two are amazing on it. Truly. Yeah. Thank you. Thank I support you. your love. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Have a great day, ladies. Yeah. Bye. <laughs>